but with the training, because as far as I know, were you just then self-trained with those guys? Is that like how you started? Because I know eventually you would pick things up and. Well, uh, Matt and Jeff, they were self-trained, but then they got trained. Yeah. Um, and, and when they got trained, I, they told me in a later in actually like last year, I did a um, thing with them at uh, WrestleCade. And Matt kind of explained to me how I was their first like real student after being trained, trained. Uh, and and they gave me a hard time, uh, really, because before I came, there were people that came to try out to be wrestlers or they were looking for wrestlers. Like they would have people at the gym that looked good. And it was like, hey, you ever thought about pro wrestling type thing? And some of these guys would come once or twice and and leave and say oh you know yeah i tried that pro wrestling stuff it's just you know they would talk bad about it or oh. go off saying they're a pro wrestler or you know what i mean and start getting bookings and they only you know came to practice twice uh or whatever and and so matt kind of felt like you know he was being too easy on these people where because he knew them so in his head i think the next time he actually had a student he was gonna you know test them and see if they really wanted it and i really wanted it you know, and so they, they gave me a hard time, but I just kept showing up. And after a while, you know, we all became family and uh, we still are, man. They, every one of them are my brothers. Did you are, always know you wanted to get involved in wrestling since you were a kid or how did you like luck yeah. into that? Uh, anybody that knows me growing up, I've, I've always been a wrestling fan uh, to a fault. Like when my fan, my friends grew out of it, I never grew out of it. Mm-hmm. And in to a fault uh, where the older I got, the younger my friends got. Because, like, my friends, you know, around 12, 13, 14 years old, it was like, oh, we don't like wrestling anymore. And so I was still kind of friends with them. But then I was mostly friends with friends that were wrestling fans. You know what I mean? Yeah. And so so, so, so I had a lot of young friends because of the fact that I was a, still a wrestling fan. So how did you end up meeting the Hardys to get trained by them in the first place? I was, um, let me see. I was, I was out one day, um, and I saw somebody putting up posters for a local wrestling event, and I really didn't know that was a thing. I didn't, I knew nothing about indie wrestling, mm-hmm. um, and but I wrestled all the way through high school, and I saw the guy's name was Commando putting out a poster for a local event, and um, I was renting the tapes. Uh, uh, Matt, they had V, VWF. Uh, tramp like no TWF it was Trampling Wrestling Federation, and uh, Matt Hardy somehow the local uh, Sand Hills Video uh, s- store somehow he had got the the Trampling Wrestling Federation videotapes. That's uh, wild. In the store, yeah, and so I thought it was cool, and so I would rent them out uh, or whatever. But like the tapes in the video store were old, you know what I mean? And mm-hmm. so uh, when I met this guy that was um putting up the posters it was about i saw the same guys on there that were on this team wrestling federation thing you know and uh it's funny because when i first started wrestling i knew the owner um the owner's daughter of the video store we we went to school together and i remember telling her that you know i'm gonna be a pro wrestler i i, I wrestle with high voltage and in her eyes, she was like, yeah, but they're the trampoline guys. Like, you know what I mean? Yeah. And I'm like, no, they're really going to make it one day. Um, and uh, and but and she was just kind of like, in a way, trying to encourage me without being like, bless your heart. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. And, and, and so uh, it, it, but 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 yeah. So then. um, So then it. uh it all just came together. So I was watching, I came to the practice. I told a guy that I wanted to wrestle. And then uh, he told me where to meet him at uh, or whatever. Cause I said, I wrestled all the way through high school. And then when I pulled up, it was in um, Tracy Cadell's yard, which is, um, which is uh, Trevor, Trevor Cadell's dad. Uh, y'all know him as uh, Cameron Grimes. Yep. So, so it was, it was his dad, his dad had the ring in the yard. 